Alright guys, I'm going to show you how to do the forced method, uh, you know, with the framework and stuff for the Verizon Galaxy Nexus. Uh, I had a pe couple people ask me how to do it because I was, I guess, one of the first to get the update. And how I did it, well, I forced it. <laughs> but this is the over-the-air legitimate uh, build version and I'll show you how I did it first get back to your home it's so the butter interface is awesome by the way it's almost too fast if you're not used to it what I did first was went to settings and you're gonna go to apps. I'm already on Jelly Bean, so I have to scroll over to all. Then you're going to scroll down until you see Google Framework. There you go, right there. Hit it. What you're going to do is hit clear data, then force stop. I'm not going to do it because I have already gone through this step. Once you do that, I'll let it sit there for about two minutes, and mine worked out a lot better than a lot of other people's did. Uh, so, just saying. After I did that, I went back to home. I did power off the phone. When it came back on, it asked me if it was okay if Google could have my location, store stuff, blah, blah, blah. I said okay. After that, I went back to settings. Went down to about phone like it, you're supposed to to check for the uh, whoop, to check for the updates I hit system updates mine was right there and it said well this will take six to nine minutes blah 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 and it was ready to go I powered it off again uh, after that, did the updates on Wi-Fi. I unchecked disable data, which you're supposed to do, by the way, as well. It's under more. I have unlimited data. I'm one of the lucky few that still have it. I was grandfathered in. And you're going to uncheck that like that. That is what you're worried about. Data enabled. Uncheck that. Connect to Wi Fi. And uh, yeah, you should be golden. That was. You just slide it over. Like that. Sorry, not going to show you guys my network because I don't know if that one's protected or not. But anyway, yeah, that's pretty much how you do it. And that brings you to, and this is on Verizon. I'm in East Texas, so I got it pretty quick. I don't know how or why, but and I do have the uh, extended battery as well. It's not too crazy goofy. 3800 milliamp hour battery 
So it lasts forever. And that's the case that I chose for it. But, uh, to each their own. Well, I just wanted to show you guys that. There you go.